Oh, shit. I was thinking about acting. I'm not an actor, but uh, it's a weird job, because it's like the only job you don't stop doing. You just do it until you die, you know? But the odd thing is, right before you die, the only roles you get are a guy who looks old enough to die. You know what I'm saying? Like, Donald Sutherland is that age now. Where, like, like, did you guys see that movie, Horrible Bosses? I'm not ruining anything by telling you this, but he dies in the first five minutes. Just of nothing. Like, he just, of extreme old age. His heart just explodes, right? And he, that means that he got that role only because he looks shitty enough <laughs> that 200 people in the theater are not going to be thrown when he just fucking expires for no reason. Do <laughs> so you know what I mean? That in the first five minutes, he was just like, yeah! And we were all like, yeah, I can totally see that that's going to happen any minute now. So yeah, I was expecting him to, I'm surprised he lasted the first five minutes of this movie. <laughs> Don't you think it's got to fuck with you as an actor, you know? I think, I really like you guys. You guys appreciated that. Like, I've been trying, like, that's a joke I thought was funny for years. Like, because I think there's something so weird about that psychologically. It must fuck you up, you know? Like Jack Nicholson, he's in the bucket list. That just, he's just a guy who dies, you know what I mean? He's like the winningest Oscar winner, like, of all time. And that's the only roles he gets anymore, you know? Just fucking Pap Hap, who passes out in a chair and doesn't wake up, you know? <laughs> the first time I tried that joke, this is true, I used uh, Richard Harris as the example, because at the time, Richard Harris was the old-ass actor who was, like, about to die. And then, sure enough, he didn't... Well, so I did that joke, and the entire crowd hated me for doing it. Like, they just, like, stared at me. But, like, in a hateful... And I was like, what's the matter? Do you guys know him? And somebody yells, he died today. I picked the day he died to try that joke. So you realize what that means? That means I'm a fucking comedy genius. He died during my joke of extreme old age. Do you realize how accurate that fucking bit is? It's kind of brilliant. Get on Twitter, fucking Jack Nicholson. I guarantee you. Hey! What? It's her 50th birthday. You thought that the dying of old age chunk was probably the appropriate moment to have fucking reminded us? But she's like half century old. There's probably some good timing there. So, hey, speaking of people who are gonna die because they look shitty, it's her 50. Happy birthday, my dear. It's the weirdest timing ever. It's adorable of <laughs> So they wheeled you on in for your 50, huh? That's nice of them. They did that for you. <laughs> She would have chimed in at that moment. See, because I know the mentality. She'd been thinking it the whole show. She was just waiting for me to take a breath. She's like, it's her goddamn birthday. i got to mention it. But she just chose the moment where I was like, yeah, it's fucking heart exploded because she's that shitty and old looking. You're like, she just turned 50. <laughs> Happy birthday. I apologize about the circumstance under which... So hey, like, listen, during my Cialis chunk, that's probably not the time for you to fucking chime in. But, hey, it's his birthday, too. I don't know what reminded me of that. Something just popped in my head. I'm just fucking with you. Thanks for taking time out from death row to be here, since you're just entirely in denim for some obscure reason. 